liquid metal battery is creating electricity from the earth by taking the graphene and hematine rods, having the infrasound hit the liquid metal, and having the nanotechnology make water, kinetic energy or Brownian motion, into electrical power. It has two input energy sources, the water and the soil, which it uses nanomaterials to make electricity from, and the infrasound in the Earth's crust, which it converts into electrostatic bursts in the liquid metal, also powering the battery cell. That was the amperage readings. Now we're going to go to the voltage readings. I'm going to show you an interesting thing about the liquid metal cell. This is probably some sort of cymatic effect, but it's interesting to look at on the surface. The two magnets are arranged so that they are at right angles to the electric field created by the electrodes. But I think the gallium nanoparticles in the liquid metal concentrate and create different gradients in the liquid metal. It's created this little thing that looks kind of like a bacterium or cilia bacterium, all the little cilia extending from the cell walls.